who I am. Well, now you do, and welcome to the family, you guys. So, I know you're thinking like, girl, new look, who this? I know, me too, me too. From Free Trust Equal, named Emerald. Now, Emerald is so beautiful, so natural, gets you like you just have your hair pressed type of look, okay? Everywhere I go, people always ask me, oh my gosh, Zoe, what, it, what did you do to your hair? Your hair is so pretty. And I'm just like, thank God, it's not my hair, but you can get this wet. <laughs> you can get this wet. Business friendly, if you wanna go and get an interview, we'll have to hop on a conference call, you know. Now, I've had this hair for a minute, you guys. The bangs were pretty long, but they were irritating for me. So we're looking for it, we're looking for it. But let's get into the details of this hair. I purchased this hair off of Dita Tress, and um, before taxes and everything, it was $54.99. And you're probably thinking, like, that's a lot for a synthetic wig. But here's the thing, not only are you getting a natural look, a good look, um, you're also getting like a human hair blend with the synthetic hair and you're also getting full lace. This hair has full lace. There is no three by four, no, no, no 13 by four, no 13 by six, no. This hair is full lace all the way through. It has two combs, it has one in the back and it came pretty quick for um, the price and everything. This is my second time purchasing this hair. Um, and will I say it's worth it? I think it's worth it because I I like to have every hairstyle that I wear look very natural and very becoming. I think this hair does that just for me. So, you know, it, it looks beautiful on everyone that I've seen do it. This is the color 1B. Um, and there's some pros and cons about this hair. Well, the pro is like the hair is beautiful, okay? The, the hair is beautiful, I can't complain. The con is that I think this hair is like meant for certain weather. Like, if you're planning on wearing this hair in the summer, I don't think you should. For the simple fact this hair gets catty real fast. Um, and then another thing, like I have to constantly trim this hair whenever I wear it. Like this is my with, with the second, this is the second wig, wig that I bought of, of Emerald. So my second time wearing it, I've only worn it like three or four times. And it wasn't long before I was like, oh yeah, I gotta wash her and she's a lot to keep up with. But she is presentable, she is elegant, she is giving you classy. So yes, she's beautiful. I, I, I can't I can't lie about that. But I will say that she for her to be a human hair blend, I'm just like, she is a lot of work. But I would consider this hair more like for a winter, a winter weather, or um, a fall weather, just because it's like the hotter or the more humid the weather is, it's like the cattier this hair gets by the day. This isn't, I would say, personally, I would say this is not a everyday wig. I would say this is a wig for occasion. So I wore this hair whenever it was homecoming around that time and she was pretty um with my outfits and everything i'll insert some pictures in the end but overall i don't think she's an everyday wear but she is definitely pretty she's definitely versatile you can have her in other ways i just cut it this way because that's how i felt like it would fit my face but as far as um just wearing her i think she's very lovely so you can choose to wear her to the side, you can choose to wear her in the middle. She definitely gives you like gasolina, you know, she she gives you Selena all day and night, you know. You can wear her up in a ponytail, that's what the, what the full lace is for, the whole lace, 100% whole lace. That's what the whole lace is for if you want to wear her in a ponytail. Um, I would not... I would not wear this hair just to be wearing it, just for the simple fact, like, it's a lot to keep up, and if you don't know how to keep up with synthetic wigs, or especially this wig, 
then I can say you're probably not gonna like the hair because um, you're gonna feel like, well, I've only worn it for one or two days. But then again, like, I'm in a very humid area. So for me, it might be different from you if you're like in a desert area where it's more dry. I can say if you are a person that's in a more humid um, setting, then this hair gets catty and this hair gets itchy. So that being said, ah, I'll let you decide. But other than that, um, this hair is very pretty, very elegant. Um, yeah, I will always keep a comb on me too, just for the simple fact, like, she always has to be pampered. She, she, I'm, I'm talking to her like she a person, but she changed me into a different person, so. Emerald, Emerald is a lot to handle, but she's also very stunning. And I think she's great for really any type of occasion because she just she just comes out so elegant okay so yes you guys i will have a link down in the description box where i got this hair or this wig yes this is a human hair blend 100 percent um full lace from free trust equal and this is emerald you guys so yes my zoe babies i love you guys so much i'll start doing more synthetic wigs because a lot of people be like girl we need more synthetic wigs. Like we we see you doing your thing with the with the human hair, but we need some synthetic wax. I understand, and I got y'all. So yes, like, comment, share, subscribe. I love you guys so much. Um, keep on supporting me. Keep on doing your best. And um, for the people that's protesting out, um, it's, it's such a terrible time in our country. If you ask me, for us to be the land of the free, and we're constantly fighting for our lives. Um, I just pray that pe this will really open up a lot of people's eyes and for the people that it doesn't like I just pray God just helps them to understand what we go through on a different basis as African Americans and even if I have any other races out here you know it's tough being African American in the United States of America and I I hate having to have this conversation with my family and my brothers and my dad, you know, I can't, I can't imagine, you know, what Joyce, what George Floyd's family is going through right now, but I, I feel so bad for what happened and I can only imagine if that were to happen to someone close to me, you know, so I just wish that at a time like this, people would realize this hatred is, is not healthy. And for this to happen after so many years of, of just trying to break free, trying to grow, I feel like this is the time for a change. Whether I'll see that in my lifetime or not, I think it's very possible if people are willing to change their mindset on racism and realize that it's not healthy and it's really silly how the change or the color of your skin determines what you can do in life and what holds you better or lower than someone, you know. So at a time like this, for the people protesting, stay safe out there. Um, make sure you have the safe equipment, um, looting is not the answer, but I do understand if you're peacefully protesting, you know, I feel like that makes more of a voice than anything. So yeah, you guys, I love you guys so much. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, stay blessed and bye.